Hello everybody, this is the Double Fruit Collector, and welcome to another video on the One Piece card game. Today, we're checking out the new released One Piece card game tutorial app. You can get this on both Google Play and Apple phones, I believe. This was released in Japan the day before this one. This one came out today, the day of recording this. You can see the bottom right, it's 6.30. It should probably be coming out four days ahead of where I am. Four or five. Well, let's jump right in. Uh, terms of use. Who needs to read it? They can have my personal information. <clears throat> First, tutorial mode one. Got a nice picture of Chopper here. Yes, I'd like to begin tutorial mode one. Tutorial mode one. Let's start the tutorial. Tutorial mode one introduces you to the basic rules of the game. Your turn. During the refresh phase, return all Dawn cards attached to cards in your field to your cost area. Instead, all rested cards in your field is active. You cannot do anything else during these phases. Or this phase, rather. Excuse me. During the draw phase, draw one card from your deck and add it to your hand. We got Zoro. During the Dawn phase, draw two cards from the top of your Dawn deck and place them in your cost area face up. That means this how many life cards we have. How many Dawn cards we have total and how many we have rested, okay? How many we have left? Okay. Just be a four. You take various actions during the main phase, including playing a card, using a card's effect, and attacking. Let's start by playing Zoro from your hand. To play a card, you'll need to pay its cost. Take Zoro from your hand and place the card in your character area. Pay Zoro's cost of three to play the card. The card cannot attack on the turn it's played. Interesting. Now, let's try attacking your opponent. To attack, you'll rest one of your upright active cards by turning it sideways. Let's rest your leader card, Luffy and, Luffy, and declare your attack. You can choose to attack your opponent's leader or one of the rested character cards. If your opponent does not have any rested character cards in the moment, let's attack their leader. Let's get him, Luffy. Kill him dead. Oh, she said. Use event cards and character cards to power up your leader. Your opponent is used the counter step to increase their leader's power. During the counter step, the player can increase their card's power by using an event card or character card from their hand. Uh oh. Ugh. Oh, it's okay, Luffy. You'll get him next time. Your opponent was able to defend their, car defend their card against your attack by increasing its power. Let's use a Dawn card to strengthen one of your, strengthen one of your character cards. By giving an active Dawn card from your crosshair to a leader or character, increase their power during your turn by 1,000 per Dawn card. Try giving a Dawn to Vivi. Here you go, Vivi. You deserve it. <clears throat> Next up, let's use your leader's effect. The effect will allow you to give one rested Dawn card to your leader for or a character. Let's give one Dawn card to Vivi. Hell yeah. You knew Luffy. You know Luffy would do it, too. Don't act like he wouldn't. He'd give her all the Dawn cards. Vivi's power is now 6,000. Let's try attacking your opponent's leader. Yeah, look at that. Well, so... <coughs> excuse me, Jesus. Um, You're telling me Vivi was Kaido's level back in Alabasta? That's insane. What were we doing, you know, waiting for Luffy to defeat Kaido? Why didn't Vivi just walk up there and slap him? Your opponent didn't do anything during the counter step, so Vivi won this time. Your opponent's life is decreased by one. Their lost life card is added to your opponent's hand. That's the end of your turn. Remember, any Dawn cards you give uh, you give to cards will only increase their power during your turn. So I think if we end our turn here, yeah, Vivi's power goes down. Let's use, let's use the counter step to increase Vivi's power. Your Brook card can increase a card's power by 2,000. Let's use that one. Alright. Use a character's counter without any cost. So just be careful you don't use too many of them or you run out of cards. Yeah, as a Yu-Gi-Oh player, card advantage and cards in your hand seems very important to me. But I wouldn't try to lose all of them. Uh-oh. 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 Uh. Let's not use a counter card this time and let VB get KO'd. KO cards are trash, and then the Dawn cards give them they're rested and return to your cost area. No, we don't want her to die! Uh oh. Okay, just close your eyes and you won't feel a thing. 
Cool. Your opponent has zero life. To win this game, you need to attack your opponent's leader when your opponent has zero life remaining. You're almost there. Hell yeah. Let's give an active Dawn card to Zoro. The Dawn card increases Zoro's power by 1,000. Now it's 7,000. Okay. Kill him. Hell yeah. Try using Zoro to attack your opponent's leader. Alright, get him with the Nonigiri. Oh. Boro Breath. Uh oh. Opponent used an effect event card during their counter step. Card has a powerful effect, which is used to return by returning a Don card to your Don deck. All right. You give multiple active Don cards to a card. Let's give any remaining Don cards to your leader Luffy, then attack. Yeah, let's kill him. Ten thousand attack Luffy. Ten thousand Luffy. Ten thousand Luffy. Let's give. Let's give. Let's go. Ten thousand Luffy. Kill him. Kill him. Hell yeah. Now your opponent can't defend against Luffy's attack, so Luffy wins. Your opponent has zero life remaining, so you've won the game. Let's get it. Okay, so I think if we end our career here, we are technically the world's best One Piece card game player, because we have never lost. Ooh, well, two cost for the stop right here. Ah, it's a counter card, so you can see, because the little bump right here. Oh, this yellow part is. I don't know what these stand for. Is that chopper a cost of one or four? It's crazy. Alright. Bro, tutorial. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Tutorial mode two. Let's do it. Oh, that's a hand and a half. Your hand isn't very good this time. In this game, you can redraw your hand one time. Give it a go. Let's do it. Yeah. Okay. It's a bit more manageable. Now that's a much better hand. Is it? <coughs> Let's start the tutorial. Tutorial mode 2 introduces you to some more detailed rules of the game. Okay. The player going first can't draw a card in their first turn. Is that me? During the Dawn phase, you add two Dawn cards to your cost area. The player going first only adds one. Okay, that's me. Okay, I'm going first. Let's play Chopper for my hand, okay? Is there a Chopper? I don't know if it for us. Since you can't use your leader to attack in your first turn, let's end my turn. What? But I have so much I could do. Not really. I mean, I guess we do. And let me examine. All right. Ah, Sheep's Head. Chopper. Oh, he's not gonna. He's not gonna attack. Oh yeah, because of summoning sickness. That's right. Now let's play Thousand Sunny from your hand. Stage cards are play played by placing them on your field. While they're on your field, you can activate their effects. If I remember correctly, Thousand Sunny can increase Straw Hat members' attack by one thousand. Why don't you use Thousand Sunny's effect on your leader Luffy? Thousand Sunny can increase your leader's or one of your characters' power by one thousand during this turn. Okay. Let's activate it. Go, Sunny! Yeah, 6,000 Luffy. Next up, let's use your leader, leader Luffy's effect. Give one of your rested Dawn cards to your leader Luffy. Alright, let's get it. Oh, one of my rested ones? Oh, wait, no. Oh, I see. Oh, so Luffy gives you one of the rested ones. That'd be kind of interesting, you know, sir. If you had a cost one. You could just play a guy, have that rested Don card, and give it to him again, boost him up a little bit, and perhaps do a thing. Not too sure, though. Oh, we're going to activate Black Maria. I believe that's Black Maria, at least. Might be Jim Rummy. I can't tell. Uh, your opponent used Jim Rummy as counter. Okay, yeah, I should have just read the text. <laughs> um, counter effect from their hand. By trashing a counter card from their hand, a player can increase their card's power during that battle. Your opponent's Kaido has gained an extra 1,000 power from the battle, so the card's power is now 6,000. I bet you they might... No, they don't have down cards. Oh, and there's ulti. Oh. Your opponent has used ulti's counter effect from their hand. Their Kaido has gained an additional 2,000 power from this battle, so the power is 8,000. Your attack failed this time. Let's end this turn. 
We went shopper though. Come on. No, I think I know what we're doing with shopper. Oh, Jack. What does he let you do? Jack's play effect. Jack's on play effect can be activated by paying the cost. Your opponent has trashed one sheep's head card from their hand and activated their Jack's on play effect. They've gained one Don card. Okay. Oh. Your opponent used Sheep's Head to attack Luffy. You're about to take some damage. You could use the blocker effect of your chopper in your battle area. Let's try using a counter to protect Luffy this turn. Okay, which counter are we using? Oh, guard point? Let's try using an event card with counter. Guard point. When your opponent attacks, you can play this card to, for, by paying its cost. Cost is one. Uh, this card's effect increases one of your card power by 3,000 for this battle. Let's use this effect on Leader Luffy. If you increase Luffy's power to 8,000, you'll be defended, defending against Sheep's Head's attack. Okay. Guard! Oh. Guard point! Yep. Okay, increases it by 3,000. Amazing. Thanks, Chopper. Kaido was able to attack Luffy this time. Let's not use a blocker. Instead, let's defend Luffy again with a counter. Okay, who do we have to counter? Let's activate Robin's counter effect from your hand. Luffy is now more powerful than Kaido, so you can defend against Cap. Amazing. Yeah, who would have thought, you know I mean? All Luffy needed was Robin to be there during the fight, and he would have been the one against Kaido. What? Why can I not activate? There we go, sorry. Yeah! Ooh, Jinbei. You have five cards. Don cards. Let's play Sanji from your hand. Okay, let's go Sanji. Now let's give two Don cards to Sanji. Once you do that, you'll be able to activate Sanji's Rush. Rush allows a card to attack on the turn it's played. Let's do it. Oh, Diablo Jambi! Go on, use Sanji to attack. Alright, get him. Kill Kaido. Yeah. Oh, he has one life card. But, ooh. Brachio Bomber. Oh, look at Big Mom's face. You dealt some damage to Kaido. What's this? It looks like your opponent is a trigger. When you take damage, if a card with trigger is added to your hand, you can activate that effect without paying any cost. You can, huh? Opponents use their Brachio Bomber trigger effect to gain one Dawn card. Very fun. Let's use a Thousand Sunnies effect on Leader Luffy, okay? Go. Okay, I can hear the uh, Club Altermon yelling to Luffy, giving him some inspiration. Then, let's activate Leader Luffy's effect and give Luffy one Dawn card. Let's do it. Now it's time to attack Kaido with your powered up Luffy. Let's do it. Luffy. Another one? Holy lord. Next up, play Chopper from your hand. Okay. There's nothing else we can do. Let's finish up our turn. All right. Queen! Oh. Okay. Quinn has a really powerful blocker. This isn't looking good. Queen's on play effect can be activated by paying the cost. Your opponent returned one Don card from the Don deck and activated the Queen's on play effect. They've drawn two cards and trashed one card. Amazing. Oh, she said. Powerful. Chopper's blocker effect. When one of your cards is attacked, you can use a blocker to have the blocker card battle instead. Let's make Chopper battle Sheep's Head instead of your leader Luffy. What? No, I don't want to do that. He's just enjoying his cotton candy. He's not doing anything wrong. Time to activate that ability. Oh, well, sorry, Chopper. Damn. Got him. Let's activate another Chopper's blocker. No.
There he goes. You don't have a counter card in your hand. Kill just had to take the damage. No. Got a great card. Let's launch a counter attack. Yes, Luffy. Oh, Frankie. Go on and play the Luffy you just drew. Okay. Let's give character Luffy two Dawn cards. When Luffy has two Dawn cards, your opponent can't use blocker against him attacking Luffy. That's actually amazing. Alright, I knew that. You have no proof I didn't. Let's use your Thousand Sun's effect to increase character Luffy's power. I better to use our leader Luffy. Then let's activate leader Luffy's effect and give character Luffy another Dawn card. Now, car now character Luffy's power is at 10,000 again. Okay. Give it to him. Give it to him. Alright, attack Kaido with character Luffy. Let's get him. Luffy! Boro Brat! Get him. Yes, I thought. Okay. So if two characters have two the same power, yep. The attacking side wins. That means Luffy's won this battle, and since your opponent has zero life, you've won the game. Let's go. That's a very interesting idea. So I mean it's very interesting also considering that the two leaders that you're given have the same power. Ooh. Ooh, do we want to use the Animal Kingdom Pirates or the Straw Hat crew? Let's, let's use the Animal Kingdom Pirates. I mean, we haven't really used... I mean, I actually... I, I think I've read this card before. And this one seems really nuts for this entire deck. So I think, I think we can use this one. Oh, no. I thought we had to choose because I saw it confirm. Oh, my bad. Yeah, start battle. Yeah, Onigashima is a crazy card. I think here we're, yeah, I think here we're alone now. Tap hold the card to read more about it. Get a handle on card's effects to gain the upper hand in battle. I think this match we're all alone. Do we want this one? Let's see, what is, um, once per turn, give one rested dawn card to your leader or one of your characters. Um, yeah, I think, I mean, I'm happy with this one. I'm happy with this one. Are we going first or second? What? Oh, I am an idiot. I did not mean to do that. Uh-oh. I'm gonna play Brook. Activate his on a. Yeah. Yeah, give it. Oh, wait, no, I didn't want to give it to. Oh. Oops. Let's do this. I'm gonna have to cut these up now. Um. Yeah, let's mulligan. Hmm, now we go with something better. Ugh. Alright, this middle one will probably be, the first two will probably be cut out a little bit. I'll put this middle one with them. Oh, I have to get better at the game. Holy hell. That's good, though. It's a learning experience for how this game will work. Also, this AI is really good at the game, it seems. Hmm. So, what does it cost for this 5,000? Um, no, no effect, though. So, Jinbei is essentially the same thing. Uh, I think yeah, Jinbei is just, like, better than Zoro and Robin here. I want to keep four of them in the deck, but, um... I'm battling second. So... Let's just keep this hand, because we got the Sanji. Um... Ooh, a Jim Rummy right away. That's how that cost one with 3,000. That's pretty fun. I'm gonna just, yeah. What does Yabo Jambe do? I haven't gotten this card yet. Uh, main, select one of your Straw Hat crew type leader or characters. Your opponent can activate a blocker if that leader. Ooh, that's really nice. Okay, it also has a trigger effect. Hmm. That is a really nice effect. Holy crap. Yeah, I'm gonna try to take over with Luffy real quick. Just, you know, see if I even can. What? 
Oh, this is my first. Wait, I can't attack even if I go second. Oh lord, that's pretty different. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm not missing anything. Yeah. Let's end. Honestly, I'm gonna, I'm gonna toss this up. Okay, so he is filling up his board with guys that aren't that strong. So that's gonna help us a lot. Okay, it cannot be blocked, so you can still counter it. Okay. I'm gonna put. Oh, I should have put Jimbe. It was just talking about how much better he is. I'm gonna keep Diablo Jambe, who you guys know for obvious reasons. I'm gonna activate Luffy real quick. Let's see if I can swing over. Wow. So Black Mirror is a blocker. She would be, huh? She would be. Oh, yeah. Sanji. Oops. Well, it's interesting because I don't know how much we want to. We might just want to keep, like, the weaker guys on their field. So, it was just unfortunate that Black Maria was a blocker, but I mean, I don't think we want to KO Jim Runby and that's just. Oh, whoa, 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 I'm sorry. You know, maybe I misspoke, but. I, I think some people will probably get what I'm getting at, you know. I want to put you on the field. I want to put Jim Bay on the field. We can put Nami on. Well, no, we're not going to put Nami on the field. Why would we do that right now? It will help boost, I suppose. Boost, boost, go in. Yeah, I suppose that could work. Skill, active. Bam. Boost, bam. Hurt Sanji. Go ahead. Amazing. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go to the Jim Rummy. Okay. Go to six. Go into the Robin. Hell yeah. Ooh, they drew Sasuke. Not Sasuke, sorry. Who's who? I'm starting to get myself mixed up. Who's going to KO? Who was that? Jinbei. Okay, that's rather fine, honestly. Um, I'm not too worried about Sasuke. Not Sasuke. He's not Sasuke. Who's who? Who's who? Who's who? Who's who? Who's who's who? Him. He's who's who. Who's going on first? King. Oh no. No. Dude, not the little dude. What the heck? Okay. There's eight to our name. What do you do? I'm gonna put you on the field. I'm gonna put Frankie on the field. I'm gonna activate you. You just like you just built like a doo 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 doo. All right, Robin. But fine, get rid of all your cards. Fine, get rid of all your cards. It does not bother me that you will not have any cards left in your hand. We don't die. Ooh, well maybe we die. Oh no! Onigashima! No, there's no use. It's no use! Take this! 
you. What did you? What was your trigger? Oh yeah. Well, I mean, I guess we should have. But yeah, we'll just use that. Pass. I'm not. Okay, we're at zero life now. We have to hope and pray. Oh wait, what's the, what, what's the trigger here? Main effect? Oh, yeah, for real. Okay, yeah, sure. What? Middle screen? There we go. Uh, yeah, get rid of you, I guess. They have no blockers though, right? I think we win. Right, so what we're going to do, Nami. Nami is going to target Sanji. Karu, get rid of him. Activate Luffy. Bam. Bam. What is he? Oh, he gives 1,000. Okay, guys, let's go. Straw hats forever. Oh, page one. Uh oh, Jim Rummy. Whoa, uh -oh. they tied. Let's go. Greatest play in the world. First try wasn't even hard. Let's go. There's no proof that it was even hard. I don't... Okay. Well, there's more coming soon, I guess. Well, I suppose that's the end of the video. Well, that's the end of the video, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. This is taking us to the main page, I presume. Yeah. Well, go check out the website. This has been... Um, One Piece Train Card Game. The tutorial app. Um, I appreciate everyone watching. I hope you had fun watching me fail twice and pulling a great succeed, but I'm mean, sure really listen to me. That was my first try, guys. I mean, come on. Everyone knows I'm the greatest in this game and will be.